this isn't going to be a nice video. Um, this video is going to be aimed at Capital Games, um, the company that make one of my favourite mobile games, um, Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. This is aimed at you guys. Um, and I'm going to be doing the event, Tales from the Outer Rim event, where you can get uh, Cara Dune, uh, Griff Kagra, and eventually later on down the line, the, you know, the, the man, the bounty hunter, and blah, 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 blah. anyway. Um, where, where, where do I begin? Um, well, first things first, it doesn't tell you anything about the character. Um, so she's rebel, tank, light side, okay. Do physical damage to target enemy if there's a scoundrel ally in the leader slot. Cara Dune gains stealth at the end of the turn. Okay, so she works well with light side scoundrels. Well, there isn't any light side scoundrels except for Han Solo. Here. Go to scoundrels. Scoundrels. See? Light side scoundrels. I don't think she is light side. I think she's dark side. No, she's light side. Quara's light side. Oh, son of a bitch. I stand erected. And so she is. Okay, son of a bitch. Okay, so in that case, I can grab you, you, Young Han, um, who else? Young Han. Who else? I can't grab my... What's my other? Oh, that's right. He's not a scoundrel, is he, in this one? I don't know why... Um, who shot first Han is not considered a scoundrel. He should be considered a scoundrel, but no, he's not. Um, mostly because they realised it would be an overlapping tag. So, we'll go light side. Uh, where are you, Han? Where are you, Han? Oh, that's because he's not. No way. Yeah, where is my? Where is June Urso? And she's not Max Stars. There's. Where the hell is my Han Solo's? <gasps> right. Where the hell is my Han Solo's? Girlfriend's happy. She just found her adapters. Um. I have. The, the Rancor Han, and I can't find him. Huh. I'm gonna have to... Yeah. He's not there in the list. Okay. Erv? Did they remove... No. They wouldn't have removed him. Hold on. I don't know why everything's taking forever to load. Um, there he is, see? I have him. So, why are you not showing up? I have the some bitch. Light side, attacker, scoundrel, okay? Yet, yeah, he's not showing up in the events listing to be put into the squad. Um, huh. I'll, I'll, we'll, we'll try it a second time. Ready? Do, do, do. Scoundrel. And don't say it's because they're not showing full star mods. Because look, even my regular Hoth Han isn't is the same rank as my Scoundrel Han. He's just not being shown. Why is that? Why can't I use my Scoundrel Han? And of course, you're going to have so many uh, uh, YouTubers... And I'm not going to say their names, but you're going to have so many 
YouTubers not comment on this. On this, they'll comment on the event. They've probably already done the event. They've probably already put all this content up about the event, but they won't talk about the fact that Scoundrel Han Solo, in my opinion, the best solo out of all the solos, isn't even showing up. Isn't even here. He can't even join the squad. I mean, look, you'll let me take a three-star freaking Borsak, but you won't let me take my my five-star Raid Han. The fuck is that, Capital Games? Let me guess. Oh, it's a bug or an oversight. No, no, it ain't. You just want us to play your game how you want us to play your game. There's there's no freedom to, to, to do anything anymore in this game. None. Because you want us to play it your way, your way, and only your way. This is some... Bullnook. This is some absolute bullnook. Well, it seems like she's used to hanging out with a bounty hunter. She can hang out with Boba Fett, a real bounty hunter, a decent bounty hunter. Alright, so we'll start the battle. That has really fucking ticked me off. Sorry. That has really ticked me off. I don't care. Shut up. I know how to use a character. Will you please stop trying to hold my damn hand? It really isn't a point. Much just auto play it. All right, dead, 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 dead. So she's basically got perma stealth. For a tank, is kind of pointless. Just saying. Why give a tank stealth? A, a, a tank is supposed to be out in the open, on the front lines, taking the fucking hit. That is quite literally the only point of having a tank. And even then, I don't even believe she gets taunt. I forgot, yes. Okay, stop holding my hand. If your account is like level 85, I believe that, that, that you really shouldn't have, like... See, and this is another thing, the auto AI is just a f***ing joke. Oh, we could easily polish off two people, but no, let's attack the one person who's still got full armor and full health. Who coded this? Like, are you for real? And you wonder why people are paying, like, freaking python coders to create bots for this game it's because your, your your current in-game ai is a fucking joke oh don't even get me started on on, on the, the the character detail the detail on, on on the character is amazing so amazing in fact that it makes the rest of everything in the game currently right now look like crap if you are trying to say we are now setting the bar at this level when it concerns the detail of this character. And you'll see what I'm talking about later on in this video. Because I will literally show you. The graphical difference between her character. And say Quara. Or. or young Han. Uh, not young Han. Um, young Lando. Who basically looks like a, a broke down pimp. I'm sorry. Young. 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 Just no. He, his hair looks like he needs to go to a barber. I need to go to a barber for fuck's sake. And I'm locked in my damn flat. Trust me. I need to go to a barber. I want to get this down. Oh, here we go. So now we get the Mandalorian. Okay. Prime example, okay. Take a look at the detail of this character. She genuinely actually looks like the character from the show. The mole is in the... Or the tattoo. The, the rebel tattoo is in the right place. 
her hair is in the right place. They, they must have done a, a 3D scan of her face. Or whoever, whoever designed her face, hire them and keep them because they know what the f they're doing. And of course, you know, the Mandalorian never takes his... Okay, so this is before... This is season one. This is before he... Um, so he's a bounty hunter. So this is before he got to do anything uber duper special. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to bounty hunters, of course, because, you know, he's a bounty hunter, so we need to get his confirmed payouts. So we're going to throw some actual... I mean, yeah, I know my bounty hunters suck balls. There's nothing I can do about it, guys. Uh, mostly because I genuinely don't play bounty hunters. Um, and I've got my reasons as to why I don't play bounty hunters. Mostly because they're just a joke. Um, with the event, with the add-in of the Mandalorian, bounty hunters, I feel, might come up a little bit. They won't be meta. Nothing's going to be meta other than freaking legendary raid. Um, yes, okay. Other than legendary raid uh, um, heroes. And I, I, I do have a huge problem with um, with the the current clan system. Um, everyone knows that, that if if you want to be good here in the game, you have to have the legendary heroes. You have to have them. And Capital Games, you know it too. Yet at the same time, you haven't updated any of the stores. In over a year, year plus, you haven't updated the stores at all. I own, I've been playing this game now for about two years, about a year and a half, two years almost, and you have not once at all updated several of the, several of the stores. I, I, I'm sorry. But you haven't. Oh, oh, okay. So a rebel leader guarantees she gets torn. Okay. So now I've got to get a rebel leader. Okay. Okay. So let's look at a rebel leader. Let's see. Let's find some rebel scum. Let's find some rebel scum. Okay. Rebel scum. Okay. Rebel leaders. Leaders. Okay. Well, uh, she's an attacker, not a leader. Oh, she is a leader. Attacker and a leader. So we could we we could do whole you know the feminist girl power kind of thing here. So yeah, let let uh, yeah no nah, fuck it don't want to do that. I'm happy with this anyway. Um, at, at at the end of the day, guys, all right? Capital Games, you're so out of touch now. It it it's it, it it's starting to show how out of touch you actually are. And as sad as that is. It's it's the truth. You are out of touch with, with everything. And I hate to say it, but you are, man. You're out of touch. Your stores haven't been updated in... Fucked if I know, if I can even remember... How far out you you seriously? I literally just recently only unlocked um, June Ursa, and that's my phone going off. Did you pass my phone? Did you pop it? I mean, li literally, you guys have barely only made it so that June Urso is even remotely close to being farmable anymore. And even then, I can't even say that that's, that's true because I've literally only just got June Urso. Someone really wants to get my attention. And it's just sad, man. It, it is. It is. It is just fucking sad. I mean, look, look at this. This so-called legendary event. She, she, 
this, this is insane. Level 85 Elite, okay, yeah, I get that, but... They have not taken a single debuff at all. I mean, it's nowhere near as bad as your le Jedi Legendary one, where the Jedi's never ever get to go because the um, <laughs> the 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 enemy are, are constantly um, too busy uh, uh, doing their actions so that the Jedi never get to take a turn. I think, see, no debuffs. Fett just didn't even get to debuff. Stuns are barely going off, which are quote unquote, uh, 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 um, you know, cannot resist. Really? Cannot resist. But these guys have kind of resisted every fucking time. Okay, my, my normal one shot kill. Don't one shot kill. Okay. Interesting. So yeah, you've 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 done you've done you've you've done a lot in in this update that you haven't really mentioned. I I really am not digging um this chick. I mean the fact that yeah, granted you you can play around with her. You can you know if you make her uh, you know if your leader's a, a rebel, she gets taunt. If the leader is a scoundrel. She gets stealth. Ah, I, I, I do like that. I think it's awesome. Uh, a little sub mini mechanic within a mechanic, but in all honesty, I just genuinely I can't see it being meta unless it's with something like HK Mando, HK, her, who else? Um, hypothetically, you know, again, this is this is a hypothetical thing, so. Mando leader, her, HK, um, Oro, Mando, her, HK, Oro, and the fifth, you know what, here, let's, now granted, Fett's going to be a stand, oh no, wait, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, go dark side, okay, so, What, her, okay, Mando, her, come on, where are you, where's Oro, my Oro is just a fucking joke, I have not had a chance to work on him at all, I really want to, there you go, Oro, the bear in mind my Oro is only level 50, you know, blah 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 blah, Oro, um, guess we could add in, He's not maxed out either. So, uh, like I said, my, I, I, I'm not a big YouTuber. Guys, I don't have press accounts. I don't have, you know, hundreds of thousands of dollars to sink into this game. I'm a free-to-play player. What you're seeing is a free-to-play player trying to come up with an idea at best. Okay. Okay. So I'm just gonna let this play play out. Nice. So is resist they are resist because they're their level is what it is. But if I walked on it, it's not a bad little team. It could it could use some work. I could probably replace Calf with Jang uh, Boba. That would help speed up the Mando's payout. I still want to know why HK is not considered a bounty hunter. 
Granted, he's an assassin, so it's not technically a bounty hunter, but you get what I'm saying. Um, let me let me try that. Let me let me drop. Okay, hunters. So let's say fat droid. Boom. Oh, that's not a bad idea. I could use Wampa. See, I've only literally just started getting Juno, so can't believe they've put her behind such a high grind wall. It's not even funny. I had an easier time getting Wampa in Raid Solo more than I did Juno, so and you need Juno, so. Because that's the only leader unit for Rogue One. The only leader unit for Rogue One. Uh, it's not too shabby. I mean, it's getting there. Boom, boom. They're all dazed and confused. She's finally putting out some damage now. Boom, boom, boom. <clears throat> Dead. Boom, 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 boom. Stun, 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 stun. Love it. Love it. So stuns galore and much, much more. Nice, nice, nice. That's a little supermarket sweep right there. I do like it. But you can even see the difference between... You can see the difference between and I'm, I'm just going to show you okay look at uh, look at Django Fett's model okay very 2017 2016 okay now look at Bubba's model which came out before him okay You can clearly see that that's a texture, that it's not actually modeled on the helmet, okay? Because there's no protrusion, there's no, no indentations, no nothing. You can clearly see that that's just a texture, yeah? As where when we look at the Mandalorian, look, you can clearly see on the helmet alone, there's more detail. Cape alone, more detail. Weapon alone, more detail that there is just in general a lot more detail put into the model if you're going to put this level of detail into the model capital games put it into all of your models because it literally looks like you just don't care anymore I'm sorry, but it does. It just looks like you don't give a crap anymore. And it shows. It, it absolutely shows that you don't give a crap anymore. And, and you want my honest opinion on something. You, 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 you asked me for to fill out one of your... And don't even get me started on that fucking joke of a movie. Or that one. Um, you want me to give you my honest... You want me to fill out your, your questionnaires and give you my honest opinion on things? Really? No, you don't. I, I, I'm literally holding back right now. If I was to give you my actual honest belief... Because this character is going to be marquee for quite some time, I'm not even going to bother. I'm, I'm not even going to bother. I'm going to leave her where she's at. I'm not going to leave her up. I'm not going to buy any packs. I'm, I'm not. I'm just not. She's not worth it. 
as is right now, she is not worth it. She's just not. Like all your marquee characters. Just not worth it. I'm sorry. There's no value there. You want me to drop anywhere between 30 and 40 pounds for a single character when I can get a triple A game. Two or three triple A games at that. For that amount. If I go to the right to the right to a store. I can get two or three. Hell. Freaking uh, 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 um, Epic Game Store is giving away AAA games right now because of the coronavirus thing, because of the COVID thing. They literally, once a week, they find a AAA game that they've already heavily discounted and say, for, the, for today only, it's free. Enjoy it. It's yours. Add it to your account. That's it. It's yours. The game is yours. You'll never have to pay for it. Now, the DLCs and various other things, yes. But other than that, nothing else. It's all yours. It's free. So, who in their right mind is going to drop, and we all know who we're talking about, don't we, Arnold? Um, don't we, Cubs? We know who's going to drop whatever. It, it, for shits and giggles, let's take a look at what this joke of an offer or offer that they give us shall we come on oh yeah 20 bucks okay will get me 30 shards which is only enough to get a ranked up once power up Kara Doom with this brand new bundle Kara Doom is a composite rebel trooper uh, that acts as a tank for rebel led squads but also works well under scoundrel leadership she was a shock trooper for the rebel alliance and is a powerful ally against empire squads uh, each bundle includes 30 shards. Each bundle includes 30 shards for Clara Dune. And, um, okay. Purchase limit one. So I, I can only purchase this once, and I'll get 1,250 crystals, which is enough for one extra pack, I might add. So basically, I'm getting two packs for 20 bucks. First pack will guarantee me to get her to four, four stars. Okay. Next one, guess what? Don't even look at anything past 15 shards. Does not happen. Okay? I know this because your pack probability, which is right here, okay, on the Apple iStore, by law, you have to post the chances of getting anything of a certain amount of rewards. Can't do it here on Google, okay? As you can clearly see, pack of, you know, can't do it here on Google. All it'll do is take you to the freaking Play Store, okay? But on an iPhone device, it legally has to show you your chances of getting said packs. Okay? And you want to know what the chances of getting anything above 25 shards is. 1.5%. So you're paying 1,300 crystals to get 5, 7, 10, 12, 15, or 20, max 25 shards. For you to get 50, 80, 145, 230, or 330 is impossible, damn near. Warrior, okay, blue, $300 live on YouTube, trying to level up one of your marquee characters. Nah. Oh, hit, hit, hit. finalize a pack. Oh, no. What else is there? Finalize a squadron. <gasps> no. Why? Because most of these characters I've already got. Vader's maxed out. Um, Cryboy, Crybaby Kylo's maxed out. Bubba maxed out. Cad maxed out. First Order Stormtrooper maxed out. Most of the ships I've got maxed out. Not that I do ships, because ships is just fucking boring. Um... Yeah, li li literally, all these packs are fucking useless. They're worthless. You get no money's worth. None. You do not get your money's worth. You do not feel justified to yourself after you've purchased um, those items. You just don't. You feel no gratification. Nothing. Nada. Zip. Zero. Zilch. You feel nothing. 
after. And I'm not joking. You feel nothing. A one shot out of nine battles. Again, another reason why this game's dying. You have quite literally been penny pinching on your shard drops to the point where it is fucking preposterous. Now, I don't use silly words a lot like preposterous. My girlfriend will tell you, I'm as blunt as a fucking hammer. I call a spade a spade and a shovel a shovel. Okay? But that is just fucking preposterous. Here you go, let's take a look at your shipment, shall we? These are in preposterous as well. Let's take a look at your Cantina Battle Store. Something you haven't updated in how many years? Now, the fact you've got Qui-Gon, Poe, Dameron. Yeah. You haven't updated this store in how long? Question mark? I don't know why Powell and Bastion are in here. They're two useless fucking characters that aren't even Z-list. I wouldn't use these characters even if you paid me. Okay, let's take a look at the guild store. Okay, has when, when was the guild store updated? Oh, when the Solo movie came out. When, when, when did the Solo movie come out? Okay, let's take a look. 2018. So two years ago, two years ago, Capital Games, two fucking years ago was the last time you updated this store. Okay, let's take a look at the Squad Arena store. When was this last updated? Let's see, newest unit in here. I would say happens to be Cassian Andor. Okay, so you're looking at Rogue Rogue One. Okay, Let, let's look at Rogue One. When did Rogue One come out? 2016! Are you starting to see the point here, Capital Games? Are ya? So, this store hasn't been updated since 2018. This store hasn't been updated since, since 2016. Let's take a look at the Galactic War store, shall we? When was this updated? Da, na, 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 na. Oh, let's see. The newest unit here happens to be K2SO. So we're back to Rogue One. So 2018. Let's take a look at the mod store. The newest store that you've added. That has junk mods. That not that I I just don't even see. Look, look, I got 24.6 million fleet credits. Wanna know why? I got nothing to spend it on. It's dead currency to me. It literally just sits there gathering dust. It's about as useful as a freaking fruitney bit. And if you don't know what a fruitney bit is, I've made my point. Let's see. Let's take a look at the Fleet Arena store, shall we? The only things in here that are worth anything is the abilities. I, 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 oh, there's another thing. How you've made a Zeta a more common drop than a Gamma is just fucking blows my mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah see? See? A mixture of Rogue One... Uh, 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 yeah, so that's it. Rogue One. Again, let's take a look at the guild event store, shall we? What did you add into here? Oh, yeah, you added Darth Merrick, General Skywalker, something I'll never obtain because, as I said, you've made the game all about haves versus have-nots. And Her uh, Hermit Yoda and Wampa. Okay, they're probably... Oh, 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 and some, some, if the moon is at the right angle and you've sacrificed enough virgins and you've sucked the almighty dick that is capital games you might you might get five five items of a specific gear set that you need when you need 200 of them why i don't fucking know but you do and then let's take a look at the championship store again something i'm just not interested in 
because again, you've made it about haves versus have nots. There is no skill cap. You said how you wanted to put it in based on your, your, your GE number, right? Wrong. Fucking wrong. I have come across so many people that have maxed out hit end game characters versus me and my sad little bunch of freaking, you know, General Akbar and freaking uh, 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 Cloud City freaking Lando Calrissian. You want to know how well that went? Do ya? And then let's take a look. Uh, 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 like I said, your stores are a joke. An absolute joke. Look, Corda you're still selling Candace Ordo and Giovanni. Darth Sion. Dangar, another character that you cannot farm. General Hux. Chief Chirper. Veteran Han Solo. Are, are you starting to see the point I'm trying to make here? Capital Games, you are so far out of fucking touch that, that, that you are hiding in your wardrobe or your closet, as you Yanks call it, yeah? Finding Christmas presents from 1977 and manuscripts for episodes of the Chronicles of Narnia. That's how fucking out of touch you are. We're playing chess, you're playing checkers for fuck's sake. That is how out of touch you are. Now, none of your fucking content creators on YouTube that are in your player rewards program are going to fucking tell you that shit. None of them will, because they're too afraid to lose their position. They literally are so scared... That they are going to lose whatever fucking position that they have with you. That they'll say, yes sir, no sir, three bags full sir. They will blow so much smoke up your skirt. Do you feel like you've pulled on a Saturday night? But not me. You want to know why? I've got fuck all to lose. I ain't ever going to be in your program. I don't want to be in your program. I'm just an average gamer, just trying to play a game. You capital games only care about the whales, the krakens. You lost touch. You lost touch. You're out of place and it shows. It does. It shows. It shows how lost you are. How out of touch you are. The fact that there's still not a PC port of this game. Sh tells us how out of touch you are. And don't tell us you can't port this game to PC. Yes you can. Because your boy Raid Shadow Legends can fucking do it. And if they can do it, you can do it. You just don't want to do it because you're too fucking lazy to do it. The fact that so many coders have taken a look at your, 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 your code in your client and quite literally wanted to rip their hair out at the fact that there's so much spaghetti code, remnant code, dead code, pointless code left in the client that does nothing, it is for nothing, it will do nothing, is beyond me. But you won't change. I, I might as well quite literally piss into the wind and pray I don't get wet. But you know what? At least I actually took a piss and didn't create one. Like this game. This game was cool probably all the way up until... End of 2016, beginning of 2017. After that, it just went downhill faster than a fat man falling on ice. And yeah, there's definitely going to be me playing a tuba. Right at the fucking end. I'm not in the mood to fuck around. I'm not in the mood to be nice. I'm not. This is me at my rawest 
get fucking used to it because I am tired of this shit. I even took a, a, a month break from this game. You can ask my clan. I've been MIA for over a month. My Discord blew up with people messaging me. Hey, Cobra, where you at? Cobra, where you at? Cobra, where you at? Cobra, where you at? Cobra, we need you. Cobra, where you at? Cobra, where you at? I didn't want to log in. I did not have the heart to log in. I didn't want to see this fucking screen. It vexed me that I literally wanted to backhand it like a peasant trying to talk to a fucking imperial king. But here I am playing it. And you want to know why I'm playing it so I can make this fucking video. So I can yell and so I can piss into the wind. So I can yell at a brick wall. So I can get this out of my fucking system. I don't care if you see this video or not Capital Games. I don't care if Warrior or whoever fucking sees this video. Thunder, you fucking name it. Cubs, whoever. Mick Mole, I don't care. Look at it, watch it, tear it apart. Don't give a shit. I don't care. And you shouldn't care either. You shouldn't care too. Because you guys are just the fucking gloves that fit on top of the gauntlet that is fucking Capital Games slapping its player base around. Abusing its player base. It literally has a captive audience with all of us being in self-isolation and quarantine. And what did it do for its player base? What did it do to give back to its player base? Fuck all. What did World of Tanks do? Give us everyone 15 days of free premium time. Rental of premium tanks. Half price on consumables. It even bought more servers because it knew that its player base would come back and increase. Has Capital Games? No. What has Capital Games done for us? Bah! Here, 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 here. Here's more fucking characters for you to spend money on. Pay us, pay us, pay us. Back in a bit. See, see in a bit. It's an Invader V moment, you know. Twenty dollars to some is nothing. So pay. But get the fuck out of my. You're doing an Invader V. You're quite literally doing an Invader V. So fucking quit before the rest of your player base says, mm, "Fuck this shit, I'm out," and flips the table and walks away. Warrior's done it once, and I'm pretty sure he's about to do it again. Yeah, I watch your shit, Warrior. Love your content, man. Anyway, as for me, I'm out. <sighs> Fucking special offers again, fuck's sake. You money-grubbing cunts. I'll see you in the next one, guys.